la 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 Hello everybody, so today I actually have an update for uh, the 1.9 one command generator that I released a video on a while back. I've made a few changes to it. Uh, one you can notice right here is that now I have there's a couple more options. So if we go ahead and just press generate right now, it will generate it without the remove sign because I decided to make that an option because it takes up a lot of characters. It's around 500 characters that the remove sign actually uses because JSON changed a lot in 1.9, so now it uses a lot more characters. So if we just go ahead and tick the remove sign and click generate, there's the remove sign. And I also added a, another option called chain. And right here, as you can see, a big thanks to TPC Bonehound because I was going to just completely redo the, uh, the generator code to support chain command blocks because I got a bunch of comments or well, not a bunch of comments but I got a bunch of I got a bunch of messages saying that and um, the A plus and B actually showed me a video where it compared chain command blocks to repeat command blocks and I was just gonna go ahead and write all the code by hand but TPC me uh, messaged me on Skype and was like hey uh, I got some working chain code and he generously donated that code to me so i reworked it a little bit i had to change some things move some things around edit a couple things so i decided uh that i didn't feel right calling that my own code because it's really not even though i edited it a lot and made it into php and stuff so i credited him uh here it is go ahead and click on here to go to his youtube i won't do that because i want to stay on this page because it takes a little bit to load youtube so this also has the remove sign option, so if we generate, there's the re remove sign, and if we don't, then there's that. Uh, hologram, it works on hologram, so it works on all of them. Uh, I decided to make this very big, this is a header, I think it's a header 2. Uh, I'm not sure why it's all the way over here. I centered it, but it's still like that. So I made it so when you click it, it pops up, so you're just kind of like, whoa, there it is. So it has to catch your eye, so you know that he did the chain code so i greatly thank him for that uh he saved me a hell of a lot of time and a hell of a lot of aggravation so big thanks to him for this go check out his channel he makes some um, some very good stuff and i i really wouldn't be able to have chain done so fast without his code so i just want to make that very apparent that he helped a lot I also added him to the credits page because he was supposed to be here before, but I had forgot to add him. I also added uh, these little share options. Uh, he was supposed to be here because he's actually the one who got me the host for the website, so I added him to the credits. Uh, the site is coded by me, designed by Scott Dash, and it is hosted by TPC, so big thanks to him for that. Here's his YouTube again. So that's about it for this video uh where is it if we come to click mobs i believe i yep uh i haven't updated this yet but i will be updating it if you've checked my twitter then you would know that i'm adding two more options i'm going to add an option for just right click detection just a left click detection and then both right and left click detection so those will uh, all three of those will be options now i'll also be adding in full npc custom uh, customization so you can add armor, names, uh, formatted things, you can enchant the armor, all kinds of things like that. I really want to try and make moving NPCs. I'm not exactly sure how well that's going to work, but I'm going to try. I'm going to try and make moving NPCs. I have a couple of ideas for how to do that. So that's going to be interesting if I can pull that off. Uh, it might not work quite as well because of entity teleportation and things like that. So this was just a quick little update video on the website. I'm currently working on clickable items, then I will finish up custom spawn eggs, which I've been working on for a while and I kind of put it on hold. And then I have custom crafting 
almost completely done, but I don't currently have the files on my PC. I have them on a different PC, so I have to go and grab those. So this is just a little update video for MC Toolbox. I hope to get a bunch more generators done for it so that it's kind of the go-to kind of website for generators because as of now there's a bunch of generators already online but they're scattered everywhere and there's really no place where there's generators compiled together so you have to memorize a bunch of different links and stuff and I, I really want to change that. So that's basically it for this video. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you check out the website and I also hope that you check out TPC because he was a big help and goodbye. Everybody's wrong, rewrote the song. Thoughts become action, tell me what's happening. Wish your mind wrapped in, wrapped around, wrapped, wrapped around. Wrapped, wrapped.